Episode 5 This audio series is the property of Lucity Films Production. Unauthorized upload of this content onto any YouTube channel is prohibited. This audio series is rated 18. Parental guidance is advised. Okay, let's take him to the hospital. And stop shouting! Stop shouting! Do you know what could happen to us? Do you know who you just killed? Oh my god, Kobe, I can't go now for this. I have, to, I have to call the neighbors, the police, everyone. I have to call. Hopefully, an autopsy will be done and, and maybe we'll be exonerated. It's even a miracle with all the noise. None of your neighbors have to come to knock to check on us. Just calm down. Look at myself. Look at my future. I can't see anything bright with this. If only I've never cheated on the day. If only I have kept my thing in check. Oh. I thank God at least the old man came alone. I'm not going down for this, no. No, I can't go down for this. I can't spend the rest of my life in prison, no. Yeah, Becky. Can we wait tonight for then we drive him out with his car? We dump him alongside the road, making it look like he was kidnapped or something. That was the idea that came into Corby's thought, which looked better than killing Becky. But her answer will only determine if she will live or not. Oh yes, Corby was desperate and ready to do anything to avoid prison. But if anyone sees us... <laughs> Look, Kobe, I, I can't do this. I can't. I have to call the police. While Becky was still crying and worried, Kobe had an idea. How he can return home as if nothing happened. What are you doing with the knife? I... <laughs> I'm not going down for this. No. Yeah, at first it was a mistake, but... I have to do this. No. Nevertheless, no, I have to no, save no, no, myself no, no, no. first. Kobe, please don't kill me, please, please, Kobe, no. I have no. to save my head. No. 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 no! <laughs>